Hello everyone, Luke Phil Smith here. Hopefully you can hear me because I'm all the way over here. Um, this is going to be a review and possibly not set up because I've never set up a gaming chair before and I know it's going to take ages. So I'm probably just going to film the unboxing and the review of the chair once I got it all set up. The X Rocker Gaming Chair Maverick of Office Chair. Oh, it's an Office Chair. I thought it was a gaming chair. Uh, it, it does look like a gaming chair, I've got, I've got, got to give it that, um, but this one has a seat tilt, nylon cast, is adjustable height, carbon fibre effect and wipes clean, perfect for them Xbox users. Um, so I'm going to be opening this up, I had this since Christmas so I haven't even looked at it yet. So let's give this a um, open and see and see what it is like in there. Okay, it's about time I, I actually got got a new chair and most of my um, other office chairs and computer chairs they all been like second hand and I've never had like a brand new one before. So it'll be good. It'll be good to get have a, have a have an actual brand brand new chair to, to use. Um, I'm kind of guessing that you need to you need to set this one up. So um, I'm just going to open it up, have a look at the contents, and then we and then we we will see. So we've got we've got some cardboard here. We have the um, looks to be the um, the handles. We've got two of these. One, two. Um, let's see what, what else have we got. We've got more cardboard here. Oh, oh, oh this is going to be a nightmare to set up. I just know it. But it's a gaming chair. It shouldn't. It shouldn't take. It shouldn't take that long. What's this? This looks to be the. Um, oh, it's stuck. There you go. Looks to be the um, accessory pack and um, screw pack right here. Um, so we'll put that to, to the side. Here, oh, oh thank God, this this is in one piece. Um, basically, the um, the base of of the, of the chair. Oh, um, my one's only got four. This one's got like one, two, three, four, five legs on it, so, so that's good. Nice and heavy as well, that's, that's what I like about it. And nice and shiny, nice and sleek. Um, what else have we got? We have, this looks to be the, um, the actual pump. Yeah. Yeah, it's basically um, to like jack up the chair and um, ma make it a bit smaller depending on your um, your height requirements. This is going to be a nightmare to put up. Got another big bit of cardboard right there. Um, this this must have fell off the um, one of the legs. We have the wheels right here. And these one, two, three, four, five wheels, okay. And lastly, um, yeah, we have the um, the the, cu the cushioning and the, and the padding. So that's this looks like to be the seat. To be fair, it, it does look really nice. I'll show you it more in detail when I get it set up. And this, 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 this weighs a ton. This is the back, the back part, the back part, the safe, the back, back part. Nice and metal hold, holder as well, like, uh, thing. I don't know, and that, like I said before, I never set up these things. Jesus, that, that, that is a lot. What else, do we have anything else in here? No, just got some cardboard and stuff. Let let me just open this up. Show you what is in this. Let me just like put this on here. 
get my knife. So yeah, we've got the um, the nuts and bolts and pack, and this, um, I'm not quite sure what's in here, I thought this was everything, what's in here, what, what is in here? The instructions. What is in here? Um, oh, um, the um, yeah, there's some stuff in the bottom of there, but this is the actual cylinder. Okay, right, that's fine. Um, I am going to um, put this together best of my ability, it shouldn't be that difficult, um, but notice there wasn't any instructions, but um, I'll figure out I'll figure out what to do, the instructions is probably on the box somewhere, but it's, it, it, it's an office care, so it shouldn't be that difficult, I'll put this together, and I will get you in a second for the actual care thing. So I'm just going to show you some pictures that are taken about the um, setup process a little bit difficult to get the um the actual bracket on the bottom seat um in but it was pretty okay once you knew what you was doing and also to get the um the back seat the the bottom part of the seat onto the backrest and hold it in in place but you got like push it in so it kind of holds in place um for it but um if you do it and have it upright you can basically screw it in like put it on your on your bed or or a table <coughs> and you can easily screw it in with the um, the washers and and nuts that and the screws that that are provided um the little l shaped tool works pretty good but you kind of do need a decent screwdriver with the um, hex um attachment on it for it to work properly um the ha the handles fit fit fine i'm just having had a had a little bit of trouble with the um with, with the one of the handle screws it just won't go on correctly so i gotta give it another go but you'll see that in the actual um second portion of this video so yeah this is the um setup process okay so here is the um the game i'm just going to call it a gaming chair because it looks like one the gaming chair all built up now the only problem is this this, this is wobbly because i can't i can't get the bolt to align properly and i don't want to um de defred it so i'm going to see if i can sort it out tomorrow um however everything's all built up the casters feel really nice i mean they're a bit dodgy on my floor but the floorboards underneath here are a little bit off um however the um when i sit down in it um it does feel nice it feels comfortable really really nice leather back tilt yeah i've got to get used to this I, I'll, I'll sort this out tomorrow i don't don't worry back tilt a tiny little bit stiff but to be fair i don't really lean back in my chair anyway so that's fine it feels nice and comfortable it's a little bit like the, the actual seat that where you sit on is a little bit shorter than my other um, chair but um, I can still sit in it, it's absolutely fine. Um, these has got nice padding on the um, on the on the armrest so so that is really nice as well. Um, I thought it was gonna be a lot more difficult to build up, it turns out it wasn't really that bad. Um, it was just a little bit difficult to get the um, the bolts to align, um, and um, yeah, like I said, I'm going to sort this 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 one out tomorrow because um, the um, the bolt just w wouldn't align, and I'm not, I'm not quite sure. Uh, luckily, it came with spares, <laughs> spares, so I tried another bolt with it to see if it to see if it will work. So I hope I'll get it all sorted out tomorrow. But other than that, this is this is really good. It's got the um, the actual. Um, gas cylinder works really well um, it doesn't really come up 
um, really high, but if you do this and then just like sit up, um, it's just it's about as high as my um other chair, chair really, if not a little tiny bit shorter, but like as long as the, as, as I don't have to like bend my legs all, all, always, it's absolutely fine. It's really nice. Now these handles, um, I really have no idea what these handles are for. Probably just start to drag it around. Um, I'm I'm not quite sure, but yeah. So um, this has been the review of the well, be fair, really nice X Rocker gaming chair. Um, like I said before, I'm going to get this handle fixed up tomorrow. Um, I hope you enjoyed this review and unboxing and I will see you in another video.